Hello guys, I'm back with a new video. In the last video I've been on main deck on this ship. I hope you already seen that video and today I'm going to make a quick round inside engine room workshop to show you which equipments and tools we have inside. Please don't forget on the end to like and subscribe if you like my videos. The most important equipment located here in workshop is the late machine. The engineers and especially fitter are using this equipment to fabricate different parts required and to make some repair. For example here or here we fabricate plugs from the Teflon bar. Behind the late machine is a shelf with different tools and spanners used by fitter here on the late machine. There we have an emergency route for escaping from here directly on the ship main deck, an air condition unit to maintain a proper working temperature inside the workshop. Nearby it's a new fabricated workbench table close to the main engine fuel valve hydraulic pump. So here is the place where we are doing maintenance of fuel injectors for main engine. Another equipment are stored here as lights, extension electric cables and portable fans. Different types of lifting equipment as shackles, chain blocks, A bolts and slings are stored here. Another fuel valve hydraulic pump in this case for auxiliary engine fuel injectors. This one is a board with different types of spanners, wrenches and big adjustable spanners. Another shelf with different types of bolts, screws, nuts. Here are some round bars from copper, bronze and teflon which can be used to fabricate different fittings, plugs or other parts. On upper shelf are different types and size of sheets used to fabricate gaskets. Here is another board only for different sizes of sockets used for socket handles and as you see there are different types of socket handles. Another shelf for storing small size of different screws, nuts, washers, o-rings and copper washer sets and also known as bestows different packings and sandpaper rolls. Next one is fitter workbench table with welding equipment and accessories. He has two boxes full with electrodes of different sizes and types. You can see welding gloves, face shield, protection and other tools. There is another working bench with all the tools and spanners required for different purposes. Spanners, open and close end, different pliers, scissors, allen keys, screwdrivers. On the right side is one shelf full with different purpose aerosols and greases such VD40, electro and contact cleaners, mollicots, lapping paste. Here it's also located an oxygen and acetylene cabinet coming from the deck where are stored few bottles. This is for cutting purpose mostly of pipes, plates or bars and for gas welding when required. On the left side of the working bench it's another shelf with many types of union and coupling connections to fabricate the pipelines or couple pipes and connections. Next we have some interesting tools, torque spanners, oil filter wrenches and wire brushes. In workshop we must have a grinder with grinding disc and wire brush. Another board with different measuring tools and pneumatic power tools, pneumatic cutting disc, pneumatic wire brushes, all works with compressed air. So this is our workshop, a general view of the workshop and a quick description of arrangement and equipment inside. I forgot to mention about the medical locker and safety equipment. There is a fire blanket in case of fire, burn kit, emergency aid kit and emergency aid wash in case if required. Thank you for watching. If you want to see the engine room round, please see the link down below in the description. Don't forget to like the video, leave your questions and subscribe for next video. See you next time.